This is Matt Bomer. And this is Jonathan Bailey. And we're here with BuzzFeed to answer some questions whilst playing with puppies. Oh, I'm really excited. <laughs> yeah, I feel good. <laughs> this is the, the easiest press has ever been. I, I know. Think. Oh, 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 done. Bye. <laughs> Bye, baby. Bye. 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 Give Johnny some love, guys. So I'll just wait patiently. Guys and girls, come on. Well, this one's a little adventurous. <laughs> oh, he's got his raccoon. We had not met, but I was a huge fan of, of Jonathan's work as an actor. And as a puppy wrangler. And as a puppy wrangler, especially. Yeah, and then we met at, at coffee, and I, I knew I had an amazing scene partner that I could trust. I wish I could bring you home. But well, this was so calm. Yeah, oh, oh, wow. Dramatically, the 50s were incredible. Yeah. And yeah. for all the reasons of the nuance of all the different characters. And then mixing that up with the 70s. Oh, oh, oh. hey, hey. He got the point. What's our love language? Yes. Like, oh, sorry, baby. <laughs> sorry, baby. Well, we could talk about our characters. I think yeah. Tim's is. What's <laughs> Oh, yeah? Yeah. And touch. I would, yeah, and Hawks gifts. is definitely touch and gifts. The strangest one were my friends in my church group in high school called me Boatmeal. I don't know where it came from. That's the strangest. I don't know. It's certainly not my favorite. Oatmeal. I think it was a combination of Bomer and Oatmeal because at some church retreat I had oatmeal in the morning. That's a sensible way to start the day. Yeah. <laughs> Slow releasing. <laughs> um, yeah, loads Everybody of calls you nicknames. JB. JB. Yeah. Yeah, jo Jono is, is my, <clears throat> my family, family nickname. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, you are yeah, so hey, aggro, hey, dude. It's all right, it's all right, look. <laughs> we get it, you're the alpha. Much like for so many people, because the strike is lifted, everyone seemed to be doing interviews everywhere, but all at the same hotels. And downstairs was Andrea and Paul, and uh, we oh, just man. got sort of no, ushered no. down and out like a, a corridor, and then uh, they were like, oh, 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 oh. it's like a full-blown gladiator match. My absolute favorite is the uh, the comment that went with the picture that was, this is what it would be like if the hobbits at the Shire got Zara. <laughs> <laughs> that comment rocked my world. Every other. You crushed no, it every no, 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 day. Like, no. I don't think you ever even struggled. No, no, no. no. Well, there's something, you know, the, the it, the filming hours are crazy yeah. in yeah, North America. It's, 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 so you can do, you know, you can film up to sort of 18 hours a day. This project especially, we, yeah, had, yeah. Some, we had some late nights. And I think I just kept looking every day, I was like, we, is this, can't we go? <laughs> <laughs> As a result of that, accent wise, you either, it either works in your favor or it doesn't depend yeah. on the moment. When I'm tired or if I've been working 14 hours, like my Southern accent can start to come back. So I have to be conscious of that too. Like what, do, what do they say like drunk, drunk, tired or angry? Hey, 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 take it easy, pal. <laughs> roller coasters. Oh, really? Like the physics of it? I was or? obsessed with roller coasters oh, as wow. a teenager. What's your favorite roller coaster? X2 at Six Flags. If we're going back to childhood, I was really obsessed with turtles. Really obsessed with turtles. I got to see some of the eggs hatching and was really like fascinated by sea turtles. I feel like you've both got, you've got a similar grace, I think, you and Turtles. The way they move. Yeah. You're, you're, you've got that elegance, I think. Thank you. Jonathan Bailey. <laughs> Without question. Matt Bomer or um, Come here. Alison Williams. <laughs> nice. Nice. Hey. Honestly, it's kind of lame, but probably just yeah. like a little extra caffeine. Nothing crazy. Oh, oh, also the lasagna at East Sodi in New York City. I think it's like a 12 layer lasagna. I always think about you and London Fog cookies. Oh, yes. Johnny brought some hey. London Fog cookies that were fire Sorry. to the set. Oh. I auditioned for, I bet you did as well. Um, you, uh, when Tarzan was on stage. Oh my God, the Tarzan <laughs> musical. And there was, a, there was a gorilla callback. If you got through the singing portion of it, you had to come back and just behave as a gorilla. 
and then transition from a gorilla to a human and then like sing the song and act as a gorilla and a human. Uh, well, Barbie, I, I was, I had planned on doing Barbie and then I got maestro so I couldn't do that because it was too much time away from my family. But it, I love Greta, I would have loved to have done that. I dressed up as like five different Kens. I had like a Malibu Ken look. I had like a classic Ken look. I really went for it. I had been aware of the phenomenon of sort of McCarthyism and how gay people were so oppressed to it. And then I just think it was such an incredible experience to go and explore 30 years, the four decades of, of the queer experience in America. Yeah. How extraordinary it is that that story's never been told. Never been told. Yeah, not on, not on screen. I knew about the Lavender Scare, but I really didn't know the specifics of it, that this executive order had been passed um, by Eisenhower because of McCarthy and uh, Roy Cohn. Oh, hey. take it easy on your, on your brother's private parts there, pal. Oh my gosh, Bradley is like, I, I, I honestly hope that every actor gets to work with him at some point because they're all fighting for the next Bradley Cooper movie. Um, okay, you got the role, you got the role. I do, yeah. Yeah, I do very much. She wrangled quite a, um, hello, magical group of people. And yeah, she's mega and also, Everyone who's worked with Phoebe is connected via theater from years ago. Thank you so much, BuzzFeed, for having us. Please tune in to fellow travelers on Showtime. And Paramount Plus. All of these puppies are adaptable from... Muddy Paws. <laughs>